talk about constructive criticism. And criticism in general. Man, as an entrepreneur, usually when you birth an idea, and someone tells you something or criticizes it, one of the first things you're going to do is, is hate that person. <laughs> Man, you're going to feel something, man. You're going to feel a sense of passion. There's going to be a sense of resistance. And it's interesting because I started making these videos right over a year ago. And just lately, I started editing them. Edited, editing them. And, uh, which I'm not going to do on this video. Um, and, I, you know, I've been playing around with this Windows Media Maker to make movies. And my first couple of tries, I put them up, right? I'm of the school of thought that, you know, try and then revise, try and then revise. So don't wait for the perfect model. You'll get to the perfect model by trying and whittling it out of, a, you know, where, where, your, uh, where your starting point is. So long story short, I get a, a comment on uh, LinkedIn. I should say long story long, right? I get a comment on LinkedIn that says, hey, you want to improve your, your audio quality. I can't hear you. You got the music overlapping. And of course, I just started doing this, and um, he said rock on, he was real positive, you know, but it made me feel a certain kind of way, this guy's criticizing my work, but it's a good thing, it's a good thing, you know, if no one's criticizing your work, you're not doing anything, nobody's watching, right, you want commentators, um, and then, there's, hold on, because I, I, I get this guy that LinkedIn, okay, great, I'm working on it, I'm thinking to myself, right, I put out a couple other videos where the volume still isn't right, and um, my wife, now here, here's the, the mother of all emotion, right? <laughs> my wife says, hey, you may want to take out that van. I said, oh, I had every excuse, right? Like, I'm working on it. I got a thousand other things to do. But she's right, right? And the guy was right. The guy was right. I do need to improve my video quality and my audio quality as I'm moving along. Um, and then I get an email from my mother. Same thing. Only three people hit me up. Only three people. A guy on LinkedIn, my wife, and my mother. Right? As I'm growing this life. So my first emotion now is is a little bit of anger. I'm like probably mad at myself, mad at the world that I didn't improve the quality. But acceptance of the, the constructive criticism, right? So my point in this video is you're going to get people that are telling you, you know, certain things about your business. And it matters. But it really doesn't matter. Like, it matters. It matters because you want that criticism, that constructive criticism to make you better. You need that. You need that to make you better. Um, it doesn't matter because as long as you're doing it, you're going to win. It doesn't matter, right? Most of the advice you're going to get a lot of times is from people that aren't doing it. They're not doing it, right? The people that are doing it generally don't give you constructive criticism or criticism in, in the same way, I should say, as someone who isn't doing it. Someone who isn't doing it is more, you know, this is what's wrong with it. Someone who is doing it can tell you, hey, this is how you can improve that, right? So there's two kinds of uh, things, but you need them both. That's my point. You need them both. So it matters, but it really doesn't matter. All that matters is that you're still doing it, you know, and that you stay positive about it and understand their viewpoint coming in usually isn't from a malicious place. It's from a constructive place, right? So anyway, as my diary, this is my diary entry, my journal entry for today, you know, uh, you get mad, man. You get, you get, there's a certain sense of emotion, but that's good. That's a good thing. That means people are watching. That means people are listening. And if you're smart, you take that. You take that advice. You take it right in the chin and it makes you stronger. It carves out a better you, carves out a better product, maybe of what you're selling or a service of what you're selling or a video that you're producing, or a blog post that you're producing, and you just keep rocking forward, man. Keep rocking forward. It's a numbers game for a lot of this stuff, right? The more you're going to produce, the better off you're going to be, man. Hope you guys are having a great day. We'll talk soon. No, I'm not a writer. Okay.